be comfortable in your own skin be ambitious it's Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Laura Kamsate and welcome. If you haven't subscribed, please do so, honey. And don't forget to like, share, and click the notification bell for more of me. So guys and girls, today's topic is about the ladies, the girls. It's about us. So I have in I have titled this whole topic she her life her choices so you know like we as women right we at times we are the ones who push each other down and we are not supportive of each other so i hope this will help some of you out there so this topic is important for us for ourselves and the ones around us as a lady as a woman as a girl young old life is quite a bit harder for us as women so we have to work twice as hard and produce twice as much so i i'm i'm not saying it is a as a sense of something very bad no 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 it's something that is actually good that shows that we as women we never give up and we know what we want that's why i said her life her choices it's because yeah we know what we want me or you or us in general we have had like people who told us that our choices are wrong our choices are bad we have bad taste in everything so before we head into the deep stuff to the juicy stuff I am just gonna give us a Bible verse from Proverbs. Proverbs 31 verse 9, it says, Open your mouth and judge righteously, and plead the cause of the poor and the needy. So this basically explains everything. Like, especially when it comes to the judging, when it comes to the you know the awful words that come out of some of the women out there yeah here on this platform i am not here to spread hate i'm here to spread love and to know that you know some things in life i also go through them i also go through emotion i also get go through betrayal all that yeah you know so in everything that we're going to be discussing as of this moment is not only something that I want to experience on my own but no I thought I should share it so that we can all experience it um you know how religion plays a part in our lives if you're Christian you know what I'm talking about if you if, if you're church goer if you know the word of God, you know what I'm talking about. I'm not here to preach, but I'm here to discuss a topic. So, let's move on to life partners, education, career, and dating. So, we all someday would love to have like a person we can call a life partner. By that, I mean like person who will be closer to us if you know what I'm saying so it does not only start from the it only start it also starts from dating like if you know your choices like the guys the guys will tell you I'm gonna go like this I want to go with this structure I want to go with this face with those type of hands with this with that with good education with good qualifications with all that you know as a girl don't be afraid to be a picker a chooser but don't be you know too picky because it might affect you tomorrow but I'm not saying that just pick every check and chill out there no 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 honey no be careful of your choices if you have an instant that okay this person is not right for me it's okay it's allowed it's allowed to be like oh no 
-mm. I can't deal with this. I can't do this. It's allowed. Girls. But just don't be too picky. You might never know what's going on next. But know that this person that I'm going to be going after or going to be in my life is this and that. Because you know, like, there have been terrible stories out there, but uh, enough of that. So, in terms of career, don't be afraid to be ambitious. Don't be afraid to be ambitious. They might tell you that, okay, don't be too ambitious. Don't be this. Don't be that. Just don't carry yourself like this. And let it know. Be comfortable in your own skin. Be ambitious. It's <laughs> It's not a crime to dream it's not a crime to pursue something that you want uh, an ambitious woman is very dangerous this and that blah 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 mm -mm, mm -mm. stop listening to people out there listen to yourself for a change you are important in the society don't also make decisions that you will regret later on continue being you like seriously and let's move on to education you know like let's be real i am not saying that going to school is very bad but yes there are some people who don't get the opportunity to but still make it in life so don't judge a person with what they have and what they don't have you're also part of that chain that somebody will also be like okay Laura um, you don't have this in your life you don't have this qualification in your life you don't have that it doesn't make you an outcast it makes you who you are because you know where you're going and you know where you're heading there are some people out there who also didn't get like an opportunity to go to university they did not qualify in the highest degree they did not have that p h d but still they made it in life i have a friend who once told me that they were like um sorry i know i said it's for the ladies but it's somebody that i know they were like my dad um, did not like pursue higher education and all that but he's one of those people who have made it in life so guys don't just limit yourself to what you have work towards what you need set your goals set your goals you know what you want you know what you want to need later on don't just be like okay just because i didn't have this and that and that in life i am being i am aiming for a life that's not mine that was not meant to be mine if it's yours it's yours and you're gonna get it one way or another you can't say that okay just because um god said i know the plans that i have for you plans of good not of evil Oh, blah, blah 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 and then you just sit at home and be like okay i'm just sitting i'm just waiting let me tell you one thing for me to be launching this channel this platform for me it's not because there are no not things out there but it's because it's something that i decided to do something that i decided to do so that i can empower myself and people can also hear my voice and i can also make it from there who knows where life takes you so in my most deepest opinion if you agree with me leave your comment or you can like what i'm about to say after this whole thing if you have understood me like in my own opinion what i think is a good choice is standing up for what you believe in standing up for yourself and the person 
next to you because you might never know who in life you will be able to to help even if it's by talking even if it's by your actions or your generosity in terms of actions or even the way you present yourself someone out there might be like I can't do it I can't do it I can't do that I can't do that just because like I don't look the part I don't do this make use of what you have now to build something that you want because you just can't get it just because okay um, I've got privileges I've got this I've got that nah nah work for what you want because right now i can say that okay i'm so comfortable in my parents house i've got this i've got that but to be honest it's not the end of me one day i'll have to go out there look for me in terms of living on my own in terms of excuse me in terms of building my own life and what advice would I give myself? The only advice that I'll give myself is cry when you go down, but pick yourself up. Be grateful for what you have. And don't forget that you also matter. And one thing don't let other people's words bring you down yes i know they are they are quite hard to listen to and to take in you know nigga <laughs> <laughs> you are not doing it for them you are doing it for you you yes i mean me <laughs> because basically i'm like talking to myself <laughs> Yeah, but I'm doing it for me, for myself, for Laura Kamsati. <laughs> and when it comes to love, it's kind of tough. And I know probably most of you might agree. It's kind of tough when you haven't met the one, but when you will meet the one, ladies, I know some of you have gone through this, when you meet the one, they say love is blind. They say love is beautiful. It's quite beautiful. It's quite alright. It's okay to fall in love. It's okay to want to get married. Even your even if your friends are like, no, um, marriage this days, this and that. But if God so willingly you are chosen for that particular thing in your life take it grab it with both hands and first ask is this person right for me that's how it is that's how it'll, it'll go that's how smooth things work out I know it might not be all rainbows, unicorns and um fairies all that because it's really reality we're talking about here it's okay to love it's okay to be loved and you've got something called self-care it's okay to be selfish i'm telling you it's okay it's okay are you serious do i even look like i'm laughing <laughs> no i'm not doubting myself but i'm saying it's okay to be selfish. Self-care Sunday. You know that everybody's like, self-care Sunday. Okay. It's okay to be selfish. You need to pamper yourself. You need to let yourself go. You need to grow. You need to grow. Because being selfish means you can sit yourself down and be like, What are the plans for today? Being lazy. Yeah. 
I know I have one of those days as all as well. We you just want to be you. It's okay to be you. And to some other ladies who might be seeing this and are married, my, maybe my age or older, sometimes you need to sit, take care of yourself. Don't when when everything just comes and then you you later on regret you'll be like okay why didn't i take care of myself when i had the opportunity take care of yourself now be selfish just a bit most important advice that I'll give you guys don't forget to bless your hustle don't forget bless your hustle hmm. girls bless your hustle bless it protect prophesy declare and decree upon yourself upon your life you, you you need you need to seek God first that's why I'm saying bless your hustle so I hope you guys have understood what I was saying I hope I wasn't too boring because like yeah that's the way I talk <sighs> or maybe it's just because it's um I'm just feeling myself you know just be like okay okay <laughs> so guys before I go, don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and click the notification bell for more of my videos and more of my posts. So guys, it's time to love and leave you. Bye. See you next week.